Jesus Christ is the light of the world, a light no darkness can extinguish. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right to give our thanks and praise. Blessed are you, O Lord our God, ruler of the universe. Your word brings on the dusk of evening. Your wisdom creates both night and day. You determine the cycles of time, arrange the succession of seasons, and establish the stars in their heavenly courses. Lord of the starry hosts is your name. Living and eternal God, rule over us always. Blessed be the Lord, whose word makes evening fall. Amen. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His mercy endures forever. Let Israel now proclaim, his mercy endures forever. Let the house of Aaron now proclaim, his mercy endures forever. Let those who fear the Lord now proclaim, his mercy endures forever. The Lord is my strength and my song and he has become my salvation. There's a sound of exaltation and victory in the tents of the righteous. The right hand of the Lord has triumphed. The right hand of the Lord is exalted. The right hand of the Lord has triumphed. I shall not die, but live, and declare the works of the Lord. The Lord has punished me sorely, but he did not hand me over to death. Open for me the gates of righteousness. I will enter them. I will offer thanks to the Lord. This is the gate of the Lord. He who is righteous may enter. I will give thanks to you, for you answered me and have become my salvation. The same stone which the builders rejected has become the chief cornerstone. This is the Lord's doing, and it is marvelous in our eyes. 
On this day, the Lord has acted. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Hosanna, Lord, Hosanna. Lord, send us now success. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. We bless you from the house of the Lord. God is the Lord. He has shined upon us. Form a procession with branches up to the horns of the altar. You are my God, and I will thank you. You are my God, and I will exalt you. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His mercy endures forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us pray. God our Father, by raising Christ your Son, you conquered the power of death and opened for us the way to eternal life. Let our celebration this night raise us up and renew our lives by the Spirit who lives within us. Grant this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God in his holy temple. Praise him in the firmament of his power. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him for his excellent greatness. Praise him with the blast of the ram's horn. Praise him with lyre and harp. Praise him with timbrel and dance. Praise him with strings and pipe. Praise him with resounding cymbals. Praise him with loud clanging cymbals. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The Lord be with you. The Holy Gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ, according to John. Glory to you, Lord Jesus Christ. When it was evening on that day, the first day of the week, and the doors of the house where the disciples had met were locked for fear of the Jews. Jesus came and stood among them and said, Peace be with you. After he said this, he showed them his hands and his side. Then the disciples rejoiced when they saw the Lord. Jesus said to them again, Peace be with you. As the Father has sent me, so I send you. When he had said this, he breathed on them and said to them, Receive the Holy Spirit. If you forgive the sins of any, they are forgiven them. If you retain the sins of any, they are retained. But Thomas, who was called the twin, one of the twelve, was not with them when Jesus came. So the other disciples told him, We have seen the Lord. But he said to them, Unless I see the mark of the nails in his hands, and put my finger in the mark of the nails, and my hand in his side, I will not believe. A week later, his disciples were again in the house, and Thomas was with them. Although the doors were shut, Jesus came and stood among them and said, Peace be with you. Then he said to Thomas, Put your finger here and see my hands. Reach out your hand and put it in my side. Do not doubt but believe. Thomas answered him, 
my Lord and my God. Jesus said to him, Have you believed because you have seen me? Blessed are those who have not seen and yet have come to believe. Now Jesus did many other signs in the presence of his disciples, which are not written in this book. But these are written so that you may come to believe that Jesus is the Messiah, the Son of God, and that through believing you may have life in his name. This is the Gospel of the Christ. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. We thank you, Almighty God, for the gift of water. Over water, the Holy Spirit moved in the beginning of creation. Through water, you led the children of Israel out of their bondage in Egypt into the land of promise. In water, your son Jesus received the baptism of John and was anointed by the Holy Spirit as the Messiah, the Christ, to lead us through his death and resurrection from the bondage of sin into everlasting life. We thank you, Father, for the water of baptism. In it we are buried with Christ in his death. By it we share in his resurrection. Through it we are reborn by the Holy Spirit. Therefore, in joyful obedience to your Son, we celebrate our fellowship in him in faith. We pray that all who have passed through the water of baptism may continue forever in the risen life of Jesus Christ, our Savior. To him, to you, and to the Holy Spirit, be all honor and glory, now and forever. Amen. I will sing to the Lord for his glorious triumph. The horse and the rider he has hurled into the sea. The Lord has become my strength and refuge. The Lord himself has become my savior. He is my God and I will praise him. My father's God and I will exalt him. The Lord himself is a mighty warrior. The Lord, the Lord is his name. Your right hand, O Lord, is majestic in power. Your right hand, O Lord, shatters the enemy. Who is like you, O Lord, among the gods? Holy, awesome, worker of wonders. In steadfast love, you led your people. You guided your redeemed with your great strength. You brought them in safety to your holy place and planted them firm on your own mountain. You brought them into your own house. The Lord shall reign forever and ever. To our God belong victory, glory, and power. For right and just are his judgments. Praise our God, all you who serve him, you who fear him, great and small. Let us rejoice and triumph and give him praise. The time has come for the wedding feast of the Lamb. O oh God, who brought your people out of slavery with a mighty hand. Strengthen us to take our stand with you beside the oppressed of this world. 
that in the victory of Christ every fetter of body, mind, and spirit may be broken, and the whole human family, restored to your image, may sing your praise in joy, freedom, and peace. Through the same Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Alleluia. May God the Father, who raised Christ Jesus from the dead, continually show us his loving kindness. Amen. May God the Son, victor over sin and death, grant us a share in the joy of his resurrection. Amen. May God the Spirit, giver of light and peace, renew our hearts in his love. Amen. May Almighty God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit continue to bless us. Amen. Alleluia.